Hi there. Today I'm going to show you how to create a good password. And these are passwords that you'd be using uh, on the internet when you're logging into different applications. And you need to remember a password. And for a good password, it needs to be at least eight characters long. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it can be eight or more characters. And it's good if it includes upper and lower case letters. So you might have, you know, capital A and a little A in your password, or you might have a capital B and a little Z, you know, to mix them up a bit. And it's also good, apart from upper and lower case letters, if you include numbers and symbols, and you know, you might include three, four in your password, and you might also include symbols like the at symbol, the dollar sign, or the hash. And um, so that's what makes a good password. But in your password, don't in don't um, use any sort of single dictionary words. Um, I think the worst password that you could ever use is the word password, even if it is spelt backwards. So I think that's a pretty easy one to guess. So I'll give those both as passwords a big the word password or and if it's spelled forward or backwards give that a big x because that's not a good password so to make it a good password it needs to be something that you can remember easily but also contains random letters and numbers so what's often good is to remember you know that use a uh, Remember a phrase, a song, movie title, or a phrase, and then just remember the first letter from uh, from that from each of the words in that song, movie title, or phrase. So, say you remember the, the song "Santa Claus is Coming to Town," and then you might start with a S for Santa and a capital C for Claus, and then I C T T I C T. T and that's six letters. So you might um, you might uh, say you know you must, your favourite number might be three five, and then you'll end it off with uh, two hashtags. Eh? So you've you've got your password there is uh, Santa Claus is coming to town. S C I C T T and thirty five and two hashes. So that's uh, you know total random uh, set of numbers and letters and symbols, but it's suddenly easy to remember. And the same thing you could do with a movie title, The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly. Oops, that's got to be a capital B for bad, and a capital U for ugly. And you can see that you're just using the first letter from each of the words in that movie title. And once again, you might add a, uh, a couple of numbers and a symbol at the end, perhaps. Or you could put that in the middle or at the front. And there you go, you've got a pretty sort of strong password. And an example of just a random phrase that you might you might be a fan of pepperoni pizzas. So you're going to say oh, a large pepperoni pizza is $10.99 plus tax. And so that becomes A for capital A. A large pepperoni pizza is, and then you actually put in the 10.99 and plus tax, and there you've got into that you've got your uh, you've got your symbol and you've got some uh, numbers, uppercase, lowercase, all built into the password. And as long as you can remember the large pepperoni pizza is 10.99 plus tax, then you've got a pretty strong password and just remember that a password is not a good password if you can't remember it so if you can remember a simple song title movie title or a phrase put make that into a password and then that's a great way to create a good password okay i hope you've enjoyed this video thanks for watching bye for now